Hi everybody, um, it's the Stupid Genius 55 here. I didn't really announce this LP much, and um, to be honest, I'm kind of doing this sort of on a whim. It's because, at the time you, the viewer, are watching this, I am going to be on vacation. Or at least I'll probably be about to be on um, vacation. <laughs> I guess I forgot there for a second. Oh, for a second I thought the game froze. I can't really... I can hear the music, actually, but... Uh, this is gonna be a bit more of a casual LP in the sense that I'm not exactly going to be... This is a no Pokemon Center run, but I'm kind of inexperienced with that. I'm gonna actually stop the intro because you can't see the uh, bottom screen. Because, yeah, this is a very... I'm not exactly doing a very... Um... Fancy run, since I'm gonna... I wanna just get this out quickly and to substitute my nor To substitute the flow of content I usually put out. So, I'm going to be doing a lot of speeding up here. Um, oh, here's one. You have to touch the middle of the Pokeball, please. Now, I'm not exactly that familiar with no Pokemon Center runs. Uh, I, don't, <clears throat> I at least know Heal Desk. I'll use the PC to store Pokemon if they're, like, perfect health. <laughs> and as well, also to release Pokemon. I'm probably going to need to do that a lot, because I'm not going to get very many others or PowerPoints. Um... I believe it's Lepa berries that restore power points, but, um, the reason I chose Platinum now, it's kind of, uh, I'm seeing a lot of, uh, Platinum Let's Plays, and I'm, I guess it's a bit overdone, but I have a lot of, this is actually a good one as far as, um, this is actually, Pokemon Diamond and Pearl were actually my first, uh, Pokemon games ever, I played it, I started playing the games when I was, uh, 10, so, um, uh, and then, we also have Barry here, <laughs> so, um, sheesh, I am not, uh, I'm saying a lot of ums here, you don't have a lot to say. Yeah, I, the, I have a lot of memories with this game, because it was my first, um, well, I'm not, I don't know if I'd say a lot of memories, it only happened seven years ago. And this opening, uh, this isn't quite as epic as Don and Pearl's opening. To be honest, in most, this is probably one of the few ways of the start of the game that's actually superior in Diamond and Pearl to, you know, Platinum. In most, I think Platinum's a big improvement over Diamond and Pearl. Jubilife TV, yes. Um, in the sense that, you know, um, a lot of the trainers uh, are harder, you know, not as many. Ooh, wait, wait, I want to set the... Ah, no, no, accidentally set the... Um... Yes, such as like settings. Um, so he's sorry if it's a bit overdone. I'm doing no heal desk run, um, aside from forced heal desks. But in this, actually, this game doesn't force you to, he to use the heal desk ever. But in other games they do. Now, as I said, I'm not too familiar with this. I'm doing this kind of on a whim. Um, I think you can understand why it's not not too many bells and whistles here. Lots of speeding up. Now, Professor Owen's got that really important guy studies Pokemon, right? I like Barry. A lot of people don't uh, like think he's kind of. You know, airheaded. Well, he is, but that's kind of the point. Uh, he's in this game. He actually, um, at the time of this game's release, he was actually the the strong in terms of just the sheer levels. He was the strongest trainer um, ever because he had a level 85. Uh, eventually, Red surpassed him again. Oh yes, Chris, don't go into the tall grass. Wild Pokemon might attack you. It'd be okay if you had your own Pokemon, but you don't. So. We'll take care. I don't, I, I don't know if some of you might... Ooh, I, I also like the uh, how this region got sort of colder. It doesn't actually show in m most of the game, really. Just the fact the character wears a jacket and this one town has snow in it. And here's a guy who talks about how technology just blows him away. Except he doesn't talk about something in-game. He talks about something outside the metagame, so that's pretty cool. I actually did see someone uh, say that this, at least geographically, this region sort of reminds uh, him or her of Canada. And, and I do think it's kind of fair, you know. It's kind of snowy, especially in the north. Um, oh, hi, Chris. Are you looking for Barry? He's gone for a second, but then he, ran, he came running back home. Um, I'm out of bag and journal, too. And hey, Chris, he'll be on the road. Finding me a million dollars. Ah, that kid. He was actually a good rival. He's, you know, my first, so... The Sinnoh region's kind of... Uh, I remember the first time I, I, fa I s was uh, hearing about the game, I used to call it the Sinu region. Actually, I've pronounced mispronounced a lot of uh, Pokemon. Uh, well, a lot of the Pokemon species themselves, a lot of areas. 
But I think that's kind of the worst I ever had. That's, that's the worst of, of offense. But... I remember. This is actually... I'm wondering if maybe... Some of you might be surprised and get into Pokemon a little bit earlier, because, like, uh, most people I know got into it when they're, like, um, age thing. I still think 10 is a good age, though. FYI. I mean, it's not... It's not that ludicrous. I, there's plenty of people who do that at 10. I didn't really get into it, though, before then, which might be a bit weird, because that's actually when it was, uh, popular. Like, really popular. Um, that's when, like, a ton of people I knew actually, uh, was really into Pokemon. Were really into Pokemon, excuse me. And... Uh, when I got to, you know, 10 years old, that's when everybody started to really hate Pokemon where I live. Like, and, and they, they, like, if you ha if you liked it, you were a, a geek, as they, they, they'd lambast you for, as, for, for being a geek, and they would, like, um, and, uh, there was, it was actually really, this might sound extreme, but witch hunt mentality, kind of. A little bit. Um... And, uh, that was, it's kind of surreal if you think about it, you know, elementary schoolers, um, not, yeah, like, where you, you can't admit to liking Pokemon in that environment. That's actually also when I was getting to the music of the game. Oh god, when I got into the game's music, I'm actually getting, uh, uh Chimchar. This, he's actually one of my favorites, um, I remember being that a, uh, I was just gonna talk about, you know, how people would hit it, and I actually used to hide my cartridges. I have this, uh, my, I used to have an iPod Touch, uh, I think it was like third gen, but when, when I had that, we actually, sorry, there is one heal desk, uh, force, did they do force you to use heal desk once in this game, and that's with your mother forcing you to do that. Uh, and Diana and Pearl, for those, um, if you didn't know, uh, this scene play, played out quite a bit differently. You actually had to go to the lake, and, and you eventually do have to go to the lake, but you actually would run to the tall grass. A couple of Starly would come out and attack you both, uh, both the main character and uh, the rival, and you had, you'd have to choose Pokemon. And by the way, Professor Rowan left the briefcase in there. Um, so this kind of replaced that. And, and this is the one time they force you to heal your Pokemon, so. Oh, and also, um, if I end up getting knocked out entirely, then I think I'm liable to get... Um, let me put it this way. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna, what I'm gonna do is I guess I will keep it. Like, I'll continue the game as normal with all my Pokemon fully healed, but I won't, like, I'll save after it so that my money is all, you know used. So there's still a penalty. I don't want to lose all my Pokemon. Then again, it would be, there are some situations where it would be worth it to get all your Pokemon knocked out in that case. So maybe, maybe this should be a greater penalty. Maybe I have to release like half my team or something. Yeah, or maybe I have to in... Uh, this is the part that's kind of Barry, like, in, in Diamond and Pearl, he did this from the beginning before we even had Pokemon. So now he wants us to go right there. You know we have a couple level fives, but at least not as bad in that game. And here's our first Cyrus moment. Oh god, I loved Cyrus at the age. I still like Cyrus and Team Galactic. Um, I remember when Super Skarmory... I was watching... Around this time, uh, I was also watching... Starting to watch a few Let's Plays. The first one I watched was... Uh, this Let's Play Mario Galaxy, but the second one I ever watched was Super Skarmory's Diamond and Pearl Let's Play. So, I remember him lambasting, uh, he didn't hate the game, but he was always talking about how third gen was superior, and Team Galactic was a big instance of that, where he would, uh, laud the game for being, should I run, or should I get the experience? I'm gonna run, I'm gonna run, I'm gonna run from those. And, uh, I need items, big time, so. I need a potion. But I remember him, uh, he hated Team Galactic, oh god, and he'd often just talk about how 3rd gen was so superior, and <laughs> so as you can tell, it wasn't exactly something I wasn't quite not annoyed with, and people are screaming behind me. Uh, that's... 
It's not, it's not like serious things, don't worry. Just like in the last video. Well, my Pokemon X and Y discussion. Um, I would like to give it a nickname. What should I call it? I remember calling it Firefighter, and because there was enough space, I actually had to misspell Fighter. But So should I call him that here? Firefighter? Um, hmm. Should I call him Pancham? <gasps> he's not a panda, but I want to call him... He's a chimp, but I want to call him Pancham. I like Pancham. Uh, by the way, the music here is actually really good. I like the opening music of Diamond and Pearl really a lot. Like, I, th I think it really is kind of... Not something else he mentioned, so I guess I could call it underrated if I use the word. For those who don't know, I never use the words overrated and underrated. I think they... Uh, for reasons that are kind of complex, I don't want to go into them in this video, but... now nah, I think I'll go with Firefighter, just like I did, you know. Um, and I'd spell it, uh, I'd misspell it, because uh, I don't have enough space. And plus, it, it you know, it, it looks like... Um, so, Firefighter. Yes, I am happy with that nickname. I have, me completely I have no idea why he suddenly has this huge turn, like, I'm, like, he's just shocked by how much, how kind I am that Chimchar. I really feel guilty, I, I don't like the opening of this game, I really, it makes me feel really gu I like the fact that your first battle is with your rival, that's good, but, other than that, the fact that they make you, I mean, so the fact that I, I basically was, did something really stupid, it makes me feel guilty to actually use, uh, the Pokemon. That's kind of, what? Oh, no, I, I, I chose, no. I can sit and... I'm oh, sorry, I can stand here without speaking for hours. I'm a very patient man. Let me ask you again. Yeah. <laughs> this is, of course, one of those but thou must incidents. Is, 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 and... I was talking about Super Skarmory, uh... You know, lambasting him. That's all I really have to say, the fact that he would... He's still a great Alp here, though. Uh, I remember. That was... They were good. Oh, my God. Um... So, I guess she's gonna show us how to catch Pokemon, because we all love those. Oh, yeah, and I forgot he gives you a, a TM in this one. I think it's, uh, not Hidden Power. Oh, uh, wait. What did it contain? Oh, no, I missed it. Uh, oh, Return. Oh, good. Yeah, you know what? I will use it sometime. And this isn't a Nuzlocke where I have to worry about my Pokemon. Not Nothing fancy like a Nuzlocke here. I don't have to worry about my Pokemon, you know, dying and making it a waste. But... Now, what was I going to say? What was I going to say? Um, I was also talking about... I still have a little bit more to say about... Uh, the fact that nobody in my elementary school liked it. Uh, it was. It, it's kind of funny to me that... Now, the games were still system sellers at the time, so like, like they still sold quite a bit. What? Oh, I have to talk to my mom. I forgot. Right. But... It was really, it's, I guess it is kind of like, in retrospect at least, it's, it's weird. Not really at the time. And, oh uh, god, especially since I was starting to listen to the game's audio. If anybody ever found out that, about that, not that I was exactly very high status at my school. Um, I never really uh, had much, you know, like, in the way of people, like, bullying me or anything. I've never had that. But I'm not exactly at the top of the hierarchy, or I wasn't at least. Well, now I'm, I'm not either, but... I basically don't talk to anyone, um, but, yeah, I have to deliver a package to Barry in Jubilife City. I like that. I actually like Jubilife City a bit. Um, for some reason, the fact that it doesn't have a gym makes it that more ornate. Like, it's kind of like a peaceful, like, sort of capital, and I can't catch you, so I'm not gonna, you know, maybe I should, I, I, you know what, I'll, I'll fight once for the experience. I'll see. Yeah, you know what? I, I can go here for experience. You know what? I should have used the return TM on Firefighter because I'm going to get inevitably get a lot of... Um... I guess I'll teach him return. Maybe I made a mistake. I don't know. Um, no heal desk and... And I also can't, you know, spam PC either. I've told you my rules of PC, so... Um, 
It's, it, it is because, and keep in mind, these same people I'm talking about who really hated Pokemon and anybody who played it at this age, um, at the age of, like, the, the horrible, like, way old age of 10 <laughs> for, um, at the time. And, uh, these people, ironically, like, were really into it, and, and I just wasn't at the time for some reason. For some reason, it just didn't appeal to me. Mm. And I'm drinking some coffee, by the way. I'm drinking way too much coffee lately. Now, I'm gonna need to catch some cannon fodder because, sort of, um, so I, because, you know, PowerPoint sort of conservation. Oh, I should probably. Oh, I, I just caught him. Um, so he's gonna be kind of cannon fodder. So we're gonna call him. I'm gonna call him. Uh, cannon. I'll, I'll just call him, yeah, nah, I'm not gonna call him cannon fodder, I, it doesn't fit. Let's see, let's call him, um... Uh, maybe I'll call him... Yeah, sorry, I just changed my mind, I'm gonna make an HM slave. Sorry for cutting there as well, but... I was getting on to my, um, I am going to use him a bit for fighting as well, though, for now. Maybe I'll catch a, a Shinx or a Starly and also use that. Let's fight this guy. Um, now, oh boy, I hope he doesn't, um, okay, I don't quite know what to say about that. Now. Oh, I could also use Return, never mind. Actually, you know what? I, I think what I can do is I can just use a bunch of uh, TMs and HMs. And God, did it really take me to that level? Okay, I'm going to use my potion. Actually, I can... I should probably get some... Uh... I'm also going to go release HM Slave. Um. Oh, I should have jumped down the other area. Shinx, I'm going to see if I can catch him. But it's kind of funny to me that the same people like really just loved it that uh, one time hated it. I'm like, dang, I'm getting lucky with these catches here. Now he is actually going to be the PP sort of user. So let's see. I'm gonna I'm gonna go a PP user with a Z just to make it all you know. Um. And during uh, junior high or middle school, depending on you know, some people call it some things, junior high or middle school. Uh, actually, no, maybe I'll make an HM slave sort of exempt from the rules, so I'll just deposit him to the PC and I'll, I'll, I'll withdraw him whenever I need, so. But I don't get to do anything else with any of the other mons. I um, also will go to this Pokemart just to get everything, anything I might possibly need. I don't need any more Pokeballs, for now. And I don't really need anything else, so you know what, I think I'm... I'll get another potion, might as well. Or another two, excuse me. Now, during junior high, it kind of was sort of the transition period. Um, well, I should probably mention first, <laughs> first that in high school, where I am now, a lot of people I know, and keep in mind, I, there's actually some people who I know who are like, uh, hockey players, of all things, um, who, who are actually really into... I don't know if I'm really into Pokemon, but they, they actually had some of the third gen games, uh, like Fire Red, you know, Leaf Green, some of those, some of those ones. And they actually were uh, talking about how much they love Pokemon, so it's kind of funny that in high school, people that in high school, then junior high, uh, people didn't like Pokemon, but then they did afterward, like like in high school of all places. So, um, now, and then and in junior high was sort of the transition period. Like, I saw, at first, there was still kind of that sediment, that Pokemon, you know, you could not admit to liking it, and in elementary school, even, I had some, they they're talking about, like, oh, those, like, third and fourth, like, when I was, a year later in grade five, I was like, oh, wow, those fourth graders, you know, into 
like at that geekpokemon.com, I always hear it out of earshot them just insulting Pokemon randomly a bit. Not not that like it was like the sole thing they're focusing on. Forgetting the impression that I think that I felt like witch hunted or you know I use the word witch hunt mentality. If you if you're thinking that I'm thinking like I was persecuted or something, I don't. But <laughs> I just kind of found it funny. And junior high was sort of the transition period there. I had. That was when... Tackle is the only move this guy has, so I better... Alright, um... I think I have my strategy here for this. No Poke Center run. Um, and... Critical hit. Oh boy, I love those. Go make some more PP on Ember. Good. Good. Alright, I'm risking it. Here. Now. <sighs> okay, actually, uh, what, what am I risking? I can just run from these battles. Good, I got away safely. Uh, I think she says some Pokemon only appear in e morning. I was expecting her to say, oh, some only come out at night, but then she did say it. Now. And I was just going to say, that took me forever to say, is that. Uh, junior high was the transition period where, like, I remember the first year I was there, nobody liked it. Then, sort of the second, uh, year, um, that's when people, like, I actually, legit, funnily enough, I remember the, the time, the exact time I noticed the sort of change, is there are these, like, advertisements they're putting up for, like, some school thi things. One of them actually just randomly had a Pokemon, like, a Blastoise on it. I just had a random, so I'm... Uh, and then, the next year, uh, I think that was when Black and... Well, whenever, uh, around when Black and White was getting released, I forget which, every... I was kind of the group of people who I was hanging out with, so, uh, sort of, um, I, I would hang out with a lot of people, and I wasn't really close, but I would hang... Like, I had one friend who was friends with a bunch of other people, and I would sort of be around them, but I never really connected with them on much of a intimate level, I guess you could say, um... I remember them getting into black and white, and that was so. That was like when it started to become okay to admit. Not only that, but then I think it that was also when it started to sort of get okay to actually admit to liking the just listening to the music as well. But then again, I think there are some people. Actually, I do remember one incident in June, in my elementary school where somebody actually did admit to listening to who was talking about game music and how game music and how it was cool. So. Not, not not just game music in general, I guess, but I'm thinking specifically, um... But I guess if I admitted to liking Pokemon music, that would be pretty... But again, I wasn't exactly somebody who was getting... Who was of high status anyway, so it's not... And by the way, those uh, two trainers to the right of me have hidden power, a TM, so... I'm using, I'm using that, I'm gonna get the experience. I'm gonna waste some power points in the process, but... Let's go to them. Barry, I'll, uh, I don't know if I ever discussed why I like Barry. Um, actually, I don't know. Well, I do know why. Uh, he, uh, he, for some reason, he actually reminds me a little bit, both in personality and the design, of the blue or the rival. You know of, you know. Oh, if you, as if you didn't know that, <laughs> but PP user is gonna get useful later, I promise. And maybe after that, I'll give him a respectable name. I shouldn't have, you know what? I, I, if I was gonna have a Pokemon that would just use like PowerPoints, I maybe shouldn't have chosen someone that had, didn't have a really good move pool at the start. So I'm starting to regret some decisions I made, and I should have healed. Oh god, I should have healed. Uh, I don't know, maybe Hidden Power will remedy that, I'll see. Not that it's such a great move anyway, but... I can take him out with another Ember. I am wasting healing moves way too much. Uh, maybe Taunt will be useful for... As opposed to Leer. I don't know if we'll keep it forever, since... Really, in the main game, it's not that, uh, good, but... 
Wait, I thought I thought I got the TM for hidden power. What? Hold on. Well, first of all, let's use a couple uh, potions. Actually, I'm wondering if I should keep. Well, I'll keep PP user, but I'm also gonna go get a Starly because that seems like a good use of my resources. Did I get the TM? TMs and HMs? No, I didn't. I thought I got hidden power from here, but okay, I thought I did. And he tells you about those types. Uh, let's maybe do that. One of these people give it to you. Oh, there's Poco. Oh, there, there's uh, this up here. X attack. I'll use one of those, maybe. Uh, let's see if the teacher has anything. Uh, now let's go to the goo that do that like clown uh, poke etch thing, uh, which I used to call Pokey Tech. It's another thing I mispronounced when I was getting into Pokemon. Uh, it wasn't until the anime that I actually saw. Uh, um, I watched a little bit of the anime after I started playing the game a bit. Not really. Uh, uh, well, what I mean is I saw the Diamond Pearl, uh, Platinum, those seasons of the anime, and I didn't watch the end, though, so... But I do know what happens in that, you know... Ash kind of loses to that guy with the, like, dark eye and, uh, that thing I other... I don't remember what he had, but I think he had a dark cry and... Ooh, Shaman, I think that's it. Now... Um... Why are people screaming behind me? Sorry if there's, like, screaming in the background, but... Um... Now, enough about how I'm getting persecuted or something. I'm, I'm, I'm seriously not thinking that I'm, like... I can't believe I used the word witch hunt mentality. I mean, I guess in the sense that it was, like, you know, if you liked it at all, you were... Which, by the way, the witch hunts, I guess, are a bit... Uh... Kind of funny that they actually happened during the Renaissance, not during the actual uh, Dark Ages. I'm not quite sure if those are actual... If that's actually accurate to use the word Dark Ages, but... I need to... I need to go catch a Starly. Um... Uh... I guess I'll buy another potion. And maybe I'll buy an extra... You know what? No, no, no. I'm not wasting money on Pokeballs until I need them. So I'm gonna go catch a Starly, and... <laughs> hope I get as good luck as I have been now. Now let's... But I am running from you, sir. Now, um... Uh... Oh boy, I was gonna say something else. Um, oh yeah, uh, Gen 3. I kinda like how Gen 4, at least now, is getting a bit more praise, especially Diamond Pro Platinum specifically. I guess the Sinnoh-based games, I'll say. Cause those are the ones, as I said, that were my first ones, and I have kind of the attachments to them. And it's really kind of nice since I remember being when it was actually out, and I was getting when it was actually you know like they were the new gens, uh, the new gen. I mean, it was very like uh, Super Scar was a big like proponent of like not uh, not really liking it as much as third gen, who thought this was very inferior, um, both in terms of designs. Uh, and I didn't go back and play third gen. I don't hate it, but it's not as good as these, I think, to be honest. To be honest, I, I, I tend to find the uh, newest version to be the definitive version. And are Starlies not on this original thing, or do they just not appear at night? I could have sworn I saw at least, like, one earlier. Oh, boy. I'm going to regret hopping down these, but I do remember there are some Starlies in this route. Because I don't know why it's happening when I'm not seeing one. There we go, but it's level two. I'm not gonna... No, I want to get one at higher level. There are higher levels than that. And I have to walk back all the way. I think I'm making a lot of mistakes here. <laughs> oh my goodness, but... Such is the case with some with a sort of LP made to be out at within... To make a lot in a, not a lot of time. Oh my goodness, I'm not really talking well at all, am I? Oh my goodness, I'm, I'm not speaking well, am I? Is what I mean to say. Alright. Okay, good, Starly was caught again. I shouldn't have lowered its health, uh, considering luck I've been getting. Uh, alright. Now, um... Uh, something else happened. So, what, 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 how's my day? Uh... 
today was like a free day, sort of, because I'm going to be really busy this week with, you know... Um, I got, like, work and uh, summer school tomorrow, and I have to, I have a final exam later this week for physics, which isn't as bad as during the regular, doing a uh, one for summer school, I don't think it'll be as bad as the regular school year, because of the school year I have to do stuff I learned uh, throughout, like, the entire year, but with this, I don't, I only have to, like, I only have to worry about stuff I've learned like this year. Oh my goodness, why can't I speak today? Um, I mean to say that I only have to worry about uh, like stuff that I learned like just a few weeks ago, like literally. So, so I have no idea why that took me so long. Although I really need to stop getting commentary out of just criticizing my commentary like a second ago. Like, hey, I'm gonna trip up on my way. Oops, I tripped on my word. Isn't that wacky? I need to stop doing that for the love of God. Um, no, I don't need a Pokeball. I need an, a potion. You can't read my mind, you store clerk. Ugh, I'll be here. Well, let's see what these guys say. Uh, just use your rappel. I, those aren't available to me, ma'am. I don't think, at least. Yeah, I don't. Uh, I've actually had, considering the awesome look I've had, um, I totally disagree with you, sir. Well, I get, yeah, so call me Colrest, because I disagree. So yeah, sorry I cut out there, uh, cut out there for a second, you know, I'm, uh, I'm not taking this to, not, not doing a lot of fancy things with this LP, so I don't really know much, I'm not going to be doing a lot of, in the way of production values, um. He has like a seven starly level wise. What? Cri what is it? Why does Quick Attack keep, keep getting critical hits? Like why? Oh my goodness! My attack fell. I think Ember is special. Would it not be? Uh, let's. At least it didn't get a freaking critical hit. Like, ugh. what? How? How'd that do so little? I thought, uh, uh, I thought I was friendlier than that with you, Chimchar, but I guess I'll go with PP user. Sheesh, I'm not doing the best I could be doing, but you, you need to get leered. The defense, you need to get leered. That sounds good. Uh, okay, how come that did so much? Okay, good, it's wasting its time on, like, defensive... Wait, why didn't I get that? Well, I basically lost PP user, and I'm doing horribly here, so... If I lose, you, you know those rules I mentioned. Now, let's... No, I oh got... Firefighter's gonna get a ton of experience, but I've lost two of my companions. Then again, I actually remember the first time, funnily enough, I ever did this... I just used a Chimchar. I pretty much completely ignored using any other Pokemon, and I just got him so overleveled. Uh, that was good times. Um, yeah, these two guys are base. Since I don't have any revives and they won't be getting any experience, they're basically dead. I'm gonna go release them right now. Yeah, uh, I may need to improve my my skill at these sometime, but. Uh, I guess I'll... I'll use him as an HM slave later, you know, since he's not going to be participating in battles. It's not really that. Um... Uh... Anything else going on in your life today, viewer? Um... So today, this is not going to go well, down well, but I, my, I had someone who wanted to use my Wii, Krikatot, Zubat, yeah, what epic, like, Pokemon there, but, oh, I should have used a potion on the chin, firefighter, um, actually I had a Wii balance board, and you know how people talk about how, like, Nintendo kind of, like, Wii Fit stuff is not exactly, uh, the most long-lasting, 
stuff in existence. Like, like in terms of, like, a lot, not, not a lot of replay value or stuff that you aren't really going to use. That's just going to collect dust, like, you know, the Wii Balance Board. My Wii Balance Board, I had someone who wanted to use it today, for some reason, and it had a centimeter of dust when I went to collect it, and it's probably not, you know, something I should be, like, well, I'm not bragging about it, but I, I just find it really funny, since... People do say that, and it did happen. My Wii Balance Board collected so much dust. It was scary. Oh boy, I am losing. I have 11 PP left for Ember. Yeah, uh... I'm just gonna go with the return here. I'm, I'm banking too much on my Ember here. Then again, I I'm gonna need to evolve Firefighter for the gym. I'm gonna have Mach Punch, so I should be good. As far as that's concerned. Oh boy, my normal moves aren't gonna do much against Machop. I'm gonna I'm gonna take another Ember. Yeah, I'm gonna take waste couple embers here, but you know what? It's Ember well spent. Now I want to get Chimchar up to level 14, so that I can you know, do stuff. I'm not gonna waste time fighting this uh person. Oh boy, we're going again. Yeah, I'm gonna need to run from these. God, PP usage is very Ah, it's hard to Taking for granted here, I was always shocked, even when I was playing through the game normally, I was shocked at how often your PowerPoint usage would, you know, not, uh, like, like there wasn't much to really uh, prevent you from... I'm gonna need to save that repel for later when there's more dangerous wild Pokemon out there, for now. Maybe I'll use it for this cave here, because I do not want to get wild Pokemon through this cave. Um, like, I don't want them affecting me. Yeah, I think repel is kind of good for here. Actually, would I be able to catch a Pokemon in here? Maybe I should catch him a chop. That'll help out during the gym. And he's telling me I need to. He's giving me Rock Smash, and he's telling me I need to face Rourke at the gym if I want to use it outside of battle, at least. Oh boy, this isn't gonna go well, is it? I have potions, and I only have one Pokemon, so I don't need to worry about using other ones. Um, but then again, I do have a pretty limited number of them, and... Did it say a critical hit? Did I... Did that one get a critical hit on me? Yeah, I'm, I'm basically... He's basically dead. Uh, yeah, it's not like tall grass. They do emphasize that case. Oh no, I didn't mean to. I didn't mean to get into a fight with this person. I wanted to just go get him a chop, hopefully. But I guess real life has different plans. Ooh, I got a critical hit, so I'm I'm getting the critical hits now. It's fun. It's fun when that works in my favor. So yeah, maybe I'll find a uh, a chop here. Zubat. Should I use a Zubat? I like Crobat, but it's not gonna be helpful against the gym. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna bother. Um, these trainers do reset themselves in terms of their positioning. Uh, how come there aren't really much but Zubats in here, it seems? Now, so, but that Wii Fit story is kind of sad, especially considering I'm not exactly the... I don't have the best physique can... You know what, this is a good level. I'm catching Zubat here. I only have three Pokeballs. Oh boy, this is gonna bode so well for me. I only have two Pokeballs, though. If I waste them, that's not gonna go down well. Okay, good. Yes, um, I'm gonna call you there a... What am I gonna call Zubat? Mike! Oh, no, no, no! Eddie the Zubat! Yes! I'm calling him Eddie the Zubat. <laughs> Eddie the Zubat. Oh, somebody's gonna take me to the Pokemon gym, and Barry's gonna be standing in front of there because Rourke is at the uh, Iron or something. And there's gonna be a lot of rock. It's gonna be a cave with like rock Pokemon in it, so it's not gonna be. It's not gonna be very good for this this guy, the stupid genius of two five. Now. Should I just refer to myself in the third person? That's kind of... 
probably shouldn't be doing that, in retrospect. I clearly need to plan my strat to rethink my strategy. And whoa, did I get that? I just realized how much money I got from uh, the stuff. Like, the, uh, the road. But then again, these potions do drain up, like, fast. So... Such is the life of... Dang, imagine if I were doing this and a Nuzlocke at the same time. Actually, since I ended up releasing both of them anyway, it, it wouldn't have really made a difference. Boy, he needs one, and then... Zubat needs... Only one as well. Good. Yeah. Now... What does this guy have to say? Oh yeah, Mount Coronet. Uh, I thought... When I was actually heard about that, I thought Sinnoh meant, like, the entire Pokemon world. I guess I'll wait till, till next time to see you guys. Have a nice day.